Welcome back to Space Haven. Now, in uh, the last episode, we uh, nabbed this little uh, jewel of a new ship here. And, uh, that is exactly what we are working on uh, dismantling and uh, getting all of the pieces back to our ship. Uh, also, uh, one thing that uh, Alex helpfully pointed out to me, thank you for that, Alex is that the hull stabilizer seems to increase the uh, hull hit points because apparently when that thing was completed this thing went down to 50% and then gradually went up again um, but I don't really know uh, that makes sense since it reinforces the spaceship's frame strengthening it strengthening it and generally improving the structural integrity and multiple of them can work in unison to bolster the hull far beyond its normal limits so i guess that makes sense but i still don't understand these uh this mass thing um that would be helpful to uh to understand how that works yeah <laughs> We are disassembling the ship game. Uh, you don't really need to worry about it. It's fine. Uh, I think I have marked everything for deconstruction. Some kind of a tool which... Uh air vent kind of a tool where i could mark several things for deconstruction like that <laughs> what do you know <laughs> okay um no further comment your honor <clears throat> i am innocent must make sure that there is no uh, characters in the way though So does each of these dismantled walls give us... Actually, I can't see what's in the crate. Okay. Yes, there are multiple hull breaches. We are quite aware of it, game. It's quite natural when we're dismantling the thing, you know? Peps wanted to have a sit down. Lazy Peps. Okay, why can I not dismantle these? Okay, let's try this. Okay, this isn't this doesn't even make sense. I guess we will revisit that at a later point. But at least we should be getting plenty of infra blocks, which is good. Tunefix is lonely. I saw someone suggested in the uh, comment field that maybe shifting the sleep schedule would make them less lonely because then they won't be working alone while people are uh, sleeping. I think that makes sense. As in, that would be... Uh, logical. But... Um, overall mood, minus five. Wow, you, you and Wally really do not get along very well, do you? Wally, you're not very popular, you know that? And you ate too much. Only Quadrotus uh, is getting along with everyone. Then again, he's a, an alien lover, while Wally is an ascetic. 
He doesn't mind sleeping on floors or eating without a table. Ah, that's the problem. He used to be a telemarketer. Of course, nobody likes telemarketers. At least I don't know nobody. I don't know anyone who does. So that makes sense. Oops, sorry about that. Bit of a drag waiting, I suppose. We could speed things up. Guess we could speed things up to the maximum. Just need to pay attention up here. This thing needs to be dismantled as well. Ah, oh, the music is so soothing. How is the uh, storage here? Oh, we have plenty of capacity. Finding this ship was a veritable treasure trove, actually, in terms of getting building blocks. I would say that this was far more uh, lucrative than... Uh, than finding, for instance, uh, a wreck to salvage. Apparently there's a fire. I am not entirely sure how that works. Considering it's in open space. Nowhere to rest, no. They are not supposed to be resting here, they're supposed to just dismantle this thing. Okay, so most of the things have been dismantled. Excellent. Now we just need to make sure that they uh, can dismantle that as well. <laughs> Need to make sure that they get the things back to um, the HSS Caledonia. Running a bit low on food. Incoming ship, of course, that's pirates. Um, post the game and prepare for hyper jump. We need someone on the navigation console, please. We'll come back here, eventually. I'm guessing that cogwheel icon means that he is permanently uh, assigned to the navigation console.
Okay, so we are ready to jump. Uh, we'll just abandon the straight for now. Hopefully the pirates won't follow us here. Um, but they will. What if I went back there? We can just jump out again if we need to. Let's drop down there. I don't know if I have to... Um assign someone to the ship when I draft it to start claiming things over here. Or if it's sufficient to just send that ship over. Probably have to draft someone though. Yep. Um, so, dock. You just dock at the air, air airlock. And Peps, you're drafted. So uh, go there, please. And now enter this. And dock there. Exit the craft. And of course, I forgot to select Peps in. How do I get him? There we go. Why? Can't I see the ship anymore? Undraft and undraft. Ah, there we go. We can claim this. to transfer oh wow energy blocks food I don't know do we need the uh, soft blocks really but uh, let's transfer them anyways Logistics overwhelmed. Yes, I can easily imagine that, considering the amount of blocks that I am transferring at the moment. to things like food. Apparently they've been eating vegetables raw. Why would they do that?
Let's uh, allow them to... Uh, okay, so they can use root vegetables and fruit. And we can use artificial meat food. Eject that monster corpse. Critical resources low, yes, but still on the sustrate, so it isn't a problem. As long as there is no critical resources low on the uh, Caledonia, I'm happy. If I remove the hull here, do we get hull blocks back? There are zero hull blocks there, we have 16 over there. Do we get more when that thing comes back? 15. Not sure why it went down. to see if this one is going down. If it doesn't do anything when they dismantle, aka if we don't get any hull blocks from it, then it's worthless usage of time. Incoming ship. Prepare for a hyper jump. There's no one over here now, is there? No. Oop. Please dock. What are you guys talking about? Junefix tried to hit on Wooly. Okay, well. The hyper jump ready? Yes, it is. Okay, so now the powers are going that way. Um, let's just leave that system behind for now. Eventually, it probably would be a good, good idea for us to uh, get some uh, weapons. No, I think we want to touch down there. Uh, Peps, you have been drafted. 
enter the craft. And uh, set that to on demand again. And you're inside, so how about you dock there? And for the rest of you, we need to build a water um, purifier. Building job not possible. Okay, now it is possible, apparently. I'm also thinking that it would be a good idea to mine these. So if someone would take care of that. This is base metals. We don't really need that. What we do need is carbon. We don't need noble metals either, but ice could be useful to get water. Okay, peps, leave the ship. Be prepared for those. Them evil biters are here, I'm sure. Although, if they are, there aren't very many of them. Maybe this was a vessel that was uh, taken out by the pirates. Whatever took it out, it's seen better days. Ship explored, undraft you, and undraft you. Um, is there anything of interest here? Uh, there is some fuel and some food, water and energy rods. We don't need infra blocks, but tech blocks. Okay, so that's what we'll transfer. And someone needs to refine water. Six ice blocks. 0 0.2 of them will create one water. So we get 10 water from two blocks. It means we have 30 water in those blocks there. That's nice. We know how to salvage. Speaking of which, is there anything worth salvaging here? Not really. We mine those, that's good. Let's speed things down again, because we also want to build... A... Where is that then? Energy refiner. Of course, that had to be one of those huge machines. It's really big as well. Okay, let's build it there then. Frankly, these, these poor people are uh, desperately trying to hit on one another.
And they keep rejecting one another as well. Wally is unhappy about having to work. I have been working. Energy. Yeah. You would be unhappy, wouldn't you, Wally? I feel that is uh, slightly fitting, actually. up a little bit again. Soft scrap, okay. Building this thing is not on their uh, highest list of priorities. Did we transfer all we should from that ship? Few things left. Incoming ship, civilians. Well, that's nice. Okay, so this thing is done, so we can make hyperfuel or energy rods. Let's make a couple of energy rods then. That water refiner seems to be uh, going out of order all the time. Okay, the CS Karmakaze another military ship and we hail them no we don't have anyone in the um, operations currently we can't trade with them though they offer some raw chemicals monster meat that doesn't sound too pleasant they have lots of root vegetables um negotiate yeah, let's just trade. They actually want human meat. That's slightly disturbing. Artificial meat. Can uh, buy a few of those and some vegetables. I don't know if we can afford this. can definitely sell them some uh, soft blocks because I don't need that money.
A little bit annoying that I can only trade 10 things at a time. Oh, we don't have any ener energium. We only have hyperfuel. Let's make some hyperfuel then instead. I thought we had energium. Maybe I forgot to mine it. Okay, so we can apparently only trade with them four times. I don't want more of those. Let's sell them some noble metals so we get their cash. I have 422 left. I'll give them one electronics component. And a couple of soft blocks. I accept. Battle Void First Contact. Ah, the game names. I love them. This thing done, almost. Let's make ten more. The Mass Knight Mira has entered the sector. We can trade four times with them as well. They have Energium. Let's give them a couple of uh, hyperfuels. Uh, we have enough of that. So trade a couple of soft blocks with them to get some cash from them. We have two more spaces. Let's give them two infra blocks then. Slightly disturbed by the fact that they want human meat, but I'll keep that in mind that when we get um, human meat, uh, I'll grab it for... Uh, Trading purposes.
Okay, so we can make eight tall blocks. Two left. Ah, so we can trade more than four times. It's only that we can have four trades active at a time. Right, okay. And we have more money, good. That means we probably are done trading with these guys. At least almost. I think we'll mine those uh, noble metals since we only have uh, one left. our energium as well. Traits, good. What we have to do now is wait for the mining of these noble metals, and we are done in this system. up. I'm not too worried about pirates coming in when there's a military alliance ship here. I'm sure the pirates are uh, wise enough to stay the heck away. Someone needs to clear up the airlock, please. The pirates are coming. Also, the Android Collective is coming. Okay, well, uh, prepare for hyper jump. But 
we got everything. Excellent. Pip's the only one who can man the uh, navigation station. I guess Pips is our trusted pilot then. Hyperjump is ready. Let's uh, jump. And I don't know if we should bother with these systems, so let's jump up here. There's not much of interest there. This probably is the jump point out. Let's go there. Please don't tell me those pirates are following us. There's a claimable ship here. Deploy there. But that will have to wait until the next episode. And I'm also worried about those pirates following us. But uh, in the next episode, we will be exploring this uh, vessel here and uh, see if we can uh, grab some uh, more items. Two warp drives. That's uh, interesting. Thank you so much for joining me. And I will see you all in the next episode.